Well, I guess we're not quite ready to do the batteries yet. I, uh, I increasingly am suspicious when people tell me uh, that they're ready for something. And uh, I was promised that the batteries would be here on Saturday. Uh, luckily, I'm, I'm suspicious. I don't trust anyone anymore. So I called the place up and they were not in on Saturday. So I would have disconnected all these batteries, traveled an hour into town, dinked around, not gotten the batteries, come back, and failed. Uh, so luckily, in this case, uh, I didn't trust them and so I can skip that step and I'll uh, find out when they're going to actually have the batteries in. They had a week to get them, but, uh, you know, when people say they're going to do something sometimes, it means that they're going to start doing it at the time that they said they'd be done. So that's what we call a, a failure in my mind. And really this gets into something more interesting, uh, and that's called what I call rolling failure, where one person's lie uh, or, or tardiness results in somebody else's inability to function, and then they fail to meet their obligations, and all the way down the line, everybody fails. And everybody gets used to that, so they, they don't show up punctually, they don't make good promises, their word means nothing, and they don't have respect for other people. And so you get a society where then nobody actually expects it to work right. So then nobody shows up on time. Nobody even tries anymore because they know if they do all the work to do a good job and, and be an honest, good person, responsible person, then they'll just be put in a bad position of waiting for everyone else and getting screwed. So I'm hoping here at the Bosque we can have a culture that isn't like that, that, uh, that people do what they say, that you can actually trust somebody that they're going to try really hard. And only in, in exceptional circumstances does that uh, not work out. Anyway, I uh, dodged a bullet today on trusting people.